this coming Tuesday. No matter the outcome, we will elect our 47th chief executive. But first, we're going to take a look back at how the presidents became president. This is your countdown to 47. Turning now to Barack Obama. Before becoming the 44th president, Obama began his political career with his election to the Illinois State Senate in 1996. He ran for the U.S. House of Representatives in 2000, but lost to the incumbent. Obama was elected to the U.S. Senate in 2004. That same year, he delivered the keynote address at the Democratic National Convention, leading some political experts to say he had the makings of a future president. And in three years' time, Obama took the leap and announced his candidacy for president. Obama secured the Democratic nomination and won the general election that November, beating Arizona Senator John McCain. Barack Obama then became the 44th President of the United States. In his first month in office, President Obama signed a Fair Pay Act for women and a bill to stimulate the economy as it was struggling through the Great Recession. In 2010, Obama signed the Patient Protection and Affordable Care Act, which proved to be one of the largest reforms to the health care system in the last half century. The act has also become known as Obamacare. In foreign policy, the war on terror continued in Iraq and Afghanistan. In 2011, Obama oversaw the Navy SEAL mission that resulted in the death of 9-11 mastermind Osama bin Laden, a significant milestone for the ongoing conflicts in the Middle East. In 2012, Obama won re-election over Governor Mitt Romney of Massachusetts, although with a smaller margin of victory than he did four years prior. In his second term, Obama pushed to repair relations with Cuba and expand trade partnerships in the Pacific. Obama also sought to negotiate a deal with Iran to limit their development of nuclear technology, specifically preventing the acquisition of nuclear weapons. In his final year in office, he signed the Paris Agreement, which took aim at lowering greenhouse gas emissions to combat climate change. As Obama made ready to exit the presidency, he met with President-elect Donald Trump to ensure a smooth transition of power. Barack Obama served as President of the United States from 2009 to 2017. I'm Eric George for Valley News Live and this has been your countdown to 47.